So in this video, I want to take a look at the difference between straight life insurance and term life insurance. Okay, now straight life insurance. What this is, it's going to require payment of premiums. Remember, we talked about premiums back at the beginning of the lesson, okay? Until the face value is reached or the insured person is deceased, okay? Now, deceased means that they have died. Okay, so you got to make regular premium payments for this straight life insurance until you get to the face value, and I'm going to talk about that in a second, or until you die, okay? Now, straight life insurance. Generally, it is more expensive, okay? But one of the benefits is your monthly rate, the amount that you pay every month or maybe every six months, whatever it might be, it's never going to go up, okay? It always stays the same. So you know exactly how much you need to, to budget for month to month in order to pay for your straight life insurance. Another additional benefit of straight life insurance. Okay, so say that you've been paying into this for a number of years, okay? You've paid a lot of money into it you have the ability to cash out that amount of money that you paid, meaning you could get the money back, okay? Or you can borrow against that amount as well, okay? Now, there are some uh, restrictions that go with that, but that is an option that would be available to you if you decide to go with a straight life insurance policy. Okay, so now how, how does this kind of work? Let's look at an example here. Say we have Jane, okay? Jane is going to pay $20 a month for a $100,000 policy. Okay, this means that Jane will pay the $20 a month until she has paid the $100,000. That's the face value. Okay, that's the amount of money that she will be able to collect. Well, not, not her, but her beneficiaries will be able to collect if she passes away. Okay, so she's gonna pay that $20 a month until she gets up to $100,000, which is not even possible, okay, in the, the normal lifespan of a human. You would never be able to get to $100,000 if you only pay $20 a month, okay? Or she's going to pay that $20 a month until she dies. Okay, now when she dies, her beneficiaries, the people that are going to collect the money, they're going to receive that $100,000, okay? That is straight life insurance. Okay, now term life insurance, this is a little bit different. This is life insurance issued for a particular period of time. Generally, it's going to be five or 10 years. Okay, generally cheaper, but it doesn't have that cash out or that loan value amount, to, or the loan value, meaning you can't borrow against it. Okay, so once you pay it, it's gone. There's no getting that money back or getting any sort of something for the money that you paid in. Okay, after the term is over, your rates are going to go up. So the amount that you pay each month after that five-year period is over or that 10-year period is over, then if you decide to renew it to go for another five years or another 10 years, the amount that you pay each month is going to go up. And you might say, well, why is that? Well, think about it. You're older, okay? As time goes by, we are more likely that, you know, the odds begin to stack against us and we're more likely to pass away. So the life insurance company is going to look at that and they're going to say, well, you're five years older or you're 10 years older. So in order to compensate us for that additional risk, you need to pay us more each month. Okay, the example here, Steve, he buys a $500,000 policy. It's going to cost him $25 a month for 10 years. Okay, so during that 10-year period, if Steve dies, guess what? His family is going to get the $500,000 or whoever he names as his beneficiary. Okay, now if he doesn't die during that 10-year period, what he's going to have to do is he's going to have to renew that policy. When he renews it, the, the $25 a month that he pays is probably going to go up. Okay, If he doesn't renew it outside of that 10-year period and he passes away, the family gets nothing Okay, because he didn't, um, he didn't die during that 10-year window. So, sorry, the family doesn't get anything. That amount of money that you paid for those 10 years it only insures you for those 10 years. Outside of that, you got to renew the policy, you know, to extend it, or, you know, you're, you're no longer insured, and if you pass away, your beneficiaries will not get you anything. Okay, so straight life insurance, it has some benefits. You do pay for those benefits. Um, and, and then the other option is term life insurance, okay? It doesn't have as much as the straight life, but it is cheaper.